This is Ajay for Tech Primers. In this session of What's in My Mac, we are going to see the software called Post Postman. So, what is Postman? So, Postman is a REST client with which we can do all the HTTP requests. So, you know, right, the get, post, port, all these are all different HTTP requests which we do. So, we can use this particular Postman as a REST client. So, what does Postman provide additionally to that? So, it has uh, something called history. So, you can have all the history saved. So, for example, if I see a particular history it, it shows me all the uh, existing history of what commands are used sometime back so for example from january 21st it shows all the uh, urls which i had hit <coughs> sorry so also it has a sign in option so if you see here if you notice here you can sign in and sync these particular options so these histories will be stored there remotely in the um, postman uh, website so that also it provides so let's uh, check out how Postman works. So I have a Spring Boot application uh, which has a controller uh, called Users Controller and I have different REST endpoints. So I have users all uh, you can pass with name and you can load using put. So let's say I'm going to search for uh, all users. So if you see here there are two different users Ajay and Tech Primers. So once I hit all I got that. So let's say if I want to search only for Tech Primers so I say tech primers and then I get the response. So if you see here, these are all recorded in the history immediately. Also, if let's say I want to add some headers, I can even do that. So I can uh, set the headers when I want to add it. So for example, let's say I want to, I create a new tab. I'm typing a get response. So you can have a header, I type content. So if you see here, this automatically suggests the different uh, keys and then the values as well. So if you see here, it automatically suggests the values so that's how you can uh, add the headers same way if you have a post so you can add the body tag you can add the body here itself you can add a key value pair of let's say if you say raw you can add the JSON directly here so let's say if you are um, I want to add something some response here I can uh, I can do that let's say I select all just copy this and then I put it here I don't want the ID so instead I say tech primers 2 and this is 1. So let's say I'm going to load this. It's about, sorry, I think in the headers I have put. So I should have put application JSON. I just say I'm going to send the JSON. It's going to return me the ID with tech primers 2. So now let's say if we go to the get all, users all, and then say all. So it returns the tech primers 2. So uh, that is what Postman is use, useful for. So I use it regularly um, at home. At her, at office, I have uh, Firefox, Firebug, and uh, the REST client. So I, I, I use REST client there. So that's it for this video. Meet you guys in the next video.